joined here by Miguel VR and Miguel, we appreciate you swinging by and joining us today. Thank you for having me. <laughs> you know, we, we just got you right off the cross country course, you know, today. And, you know, let's just kind of recap. You got back from the Chicago area a little bit ago. You guys are a few meets in. Just kind of talk about, you know, how you're feeling and the team so far. Yeah, so that was a good experience, just a lot of positive and negatives. Um, we learned a lot of things that we need to work on, and I think we will work on and fix. And some positives, just good competition and good experience with a lot of people we're going to see uh, down the road. And uh, I think we're progressing really well throughout the season, and that was just another stepping stone in the right direction. And yeah, I really right now and that was just another good experience to have. You know we've been able to go out on Ash Creek Preserve a few times. How nice is it to be able to you know run on your home course knowing that we'll have regionals again here in a couple of weeks? Yeah it's super fun and exciting being able to practice there and uh, really get to know the course. There's a lot of advantages to just knowing how to feel on the, like on the berms, how to feel comfortable going at like each section and uh, obviously we're trying to be at our absolute best this regional championship so I think coach will be able to get us there. What were kind of your you know, expectations coming in, you know, coming to a new school, you know, and also, uh, you know, obviously last year was very weird, you know, with COVID not being able to compete. So what was kind of that, you know, whole transition for you to try to end up, you know, figuring out where you wanted to go and what were your expectations coming in? Yeah, so expectations, I didn't really have too many. I was kind of unsure of everything. Uh, I just, I just knew Zach because he was a grad assistant at Adams and so I really liked him. Him when he was over there, he was a really cool guy, and we had a lot of great conversations. And so it was the first at first the transition is always kind of hard, but the guys here made it a lot easier. The great coaches stuff made it a lot easier, and I think right now, like I'm really really comfortable. And so I mean, every transition has its difficulties and challenges, but. I, I, the people and the place, the atmosphere, everything kind of made it as smooth as it could possibly go. And how about for you, you know, specifically for the sport, you know, of cross and track, what kind of got you into it growing up and what do you enjoy the most about it? Just kind of the community. Like I met some amazing people through it, like especially my roommates and this coaching staff. I wouldn't have met any of them without uh, the sport. And they bring out the best of me. And I think there's beauty and challenges, and this, just like all sports, you yeah, have your challenges with running. You can uh, push yourself as much as you like with mileage and intensity, and you have to really learn what works best for you and what brings the best out of you. All right, Miguel. Well, we really appreciate you, you know, swinging by, spending a few minutes with us. Great to catch up with you. Best of luck the rest of the season. I'm sure we'll be catching up with you here again soon. Thank you. Appreciate it.